hi there. Um, so I was doing, you know, I was gonna film the room tour video, but it's kind of messy. So let me clean all this up, and then we can get into it. Okay, cool. See you guys in a second. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Hey there, boys. Anger and gamers, what do you want to call it? I'm just going to fix this before. Bro, it is super duper bright. Let me fix this. Let me fix it. It's so bright. Hi, hello, salutations, and good afternoon. Welcome, 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 welcome to another, you can call it a vlog? I'm not, it's not really a vlog. It's kind of a vlog. It's not really a vlog. It kind of is, kind of not. But it's a room tour video, because a lot of people have been asking about it. So I was like, I'll film it. This is actually my second time filming, because the first time I filmed it, the footage got deleted or moved somewhere. I don't know where it is. So I feel like the, the easiest way is to start on like this side of the room. They're like that's like the front door to my room. And then like go around. Probably like easiest way. Do that. Also don't get dizzy. Don't get dizzy. If you get dizzy, apologize, but I'll try not to get you guys too dizzy. So this is what you guys see like is the setup's over there. And so this is what you see like directly behind me, but you can't really see because it's kind of out of focus, but yeah. So this is like my memorabilia type stuff over here. So like on the top we have, so we're shipped on Transformers over here because I love Transformers. And wait, let me fix Predacon up here. And my boy, my boy fell. It's my boy. There we go. There we go. So a bunch of Transformers from different series and stuff. Bro, all of them are fall. I didn't even notice these guys falling over here. I didn't even notice. There we go. Different series and movie things, all like that. This is actually custom one my friend made. Over here, so it's like a custom one. He had like custom pieces and stuff on it. Super lit. But yeah, so that's like all Transformers up there because I love Transformers. I used to have a lot more, but I got rid of a lot of them because I didn't I didn't have enough room for them all. So these are just some of like my favorites and stuff that I've had for a while. Um, down here is my Amiibo connection. Co connection. Collection. So we have like a Pac-Man. Uh... Mario, Mewtwo, Palutena, and a Pika Pika. Both have damage right there because he's so big, he couldn't fit over here with all the other ones. So I'll put him over here because he's so freaking big. Um, we have a Harry Potter wand from, um, okay. <laughs> we have a Harry Potter wand from Wizarding World. I actually got this from Ollivander himself. Like we actually did, I did like the whole like wand thing and I actually got this wand. It's my, it's actually my favorite wand too. So it actually worked out. Um, so down here, have like more stuff a lot of this stuff actually came from like loot crates so like this stuff down is like loot crates and like sci-fi crates and other things that i've gotten but we have like cups like star lord cups c3po uh darth vader carnage we have like a uh like a face hugger but it's like a cart it's like a, it's like a playful face hugger you know playful face hugger so it's like it wouldn't feel as bad if it wants like it wants to be your friend it just wants to be your friend it just wants to be your friend it just wants to be but yeah, so we have also have like little figures, like we have a like little 8-bit uh, Space Invaders thing right here. Um, have a Star Wars belt buckle. I got from my friend. It's kind of cool. Kind of lit. A uh, little thing that lunchboxes, like a, a Halo lunchbox right here. Uh, I don't know if you can really tell if it's Halo, but it's Halo. Uh, we got a Ghostbusters one over here. We have other boxes and stuff down here for like graphics cards and other stuff. We have a power glove mitten. We also have a uh, Captain Marvel popcorn tug. That's actually really, really cool. Um, the focus is just off on everything right now. So next to that, we have my Thor. Uh, you want know to call it memora memorabilia? I guess we can call it that. My Thor shrine, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, so we have Thor action figures. They have an old one. So there, another one over here. Uh, we have a custom paddle from a summer camp that I work every. Uh, that I work every uh, summer. All the counselors make paddles for each other. So because I like Thor and people you know like Thor, I have a Thor. I have like a couple Thor paddles and it's super lit. And I also have a, a Mjolnir over here from the original Thor movie, which is really cool. Um, I think this is just filled with Yu-Gi-Oh cards, I believe. It's just filled with Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Yes. So it's just my Yu-Gi-Oh cards because I did play Yu-Gi-Oh. So, yar. And we have a Justice League poster, which I have posters all over the room because I like I like. 
personalizing my room. You know, I want people to walk in and be like, oh, so this is what he's all about. You know? So even in my first apartment, I'll do, a, I guess when I get up my first apartment, I'll get, I do like an apartment tour or whatever. But you, you, it will be super nerdy. So we have like Justice League poster, we have like Marvel poster, and then it's super overexposed. Uh, Star Wars poster, DC, Marvel, Star Wars. It's a pattern, you know, it's a pattern. pattern there. Um, this is my, this is actually my closet right here. So it's just like clothes and stuff. Like clothes, like this is all like work clothes, I guess you wanna call it. Work clothes or like fancy clothes. So I have like my merch here, my merch here. Just scroll through, you know. I've got my merch, and I have my uh, jersey right here. You know, my jersey, my jersey, and stuff like that. I have a shit ton of boxes because uh, when I move, when I move out uh, in a couple months, I want to have make sure I have a box for everything, so it's a lot easier to move everything without stacking stuff on top of it. So I keep all my boxes for all my stuff. You know, it's really really smart to do that. You know, uh, and then we have other stuff. We have like shoes. Random shit. I have a shit ton of posters. Actually, I have like a shit ton of posters back there. Like so many posters. Like literally, my apartment's gonna have so many posters in it. It's gonna be lit. Uh, my hat collection. I need more hats, by the way. I most definitely need more hats. So we have like Batman. Uh, we have like Flash. We have like Marvel, uh, Star Wars. Some more Star Wars hats. Um, yeah, I need more hats, by the way. I also have these hats too. I have like an Australian pop Australian hat. They have like a cowboy hat. Super lit. Super duper lit. But yeah, there's not much else in the closet. Um. That's full of watches right here. This little yellow thing. It's like full of like watches and things. But yeah, that's a basket of dirty clothes because I am terrible at doing laundry. Um, yeah, I eat. And on the doors we have posters. So we have uh, Beta Ray Bill. Uh, we have Nightwing. We have a He-Man. And also have an Affinity Gauntlet. Posters. I got these from a comic con I went to a couple years ago. I don't know, well, more than that, probably three or four years ago. Um, there's like a comic book store that has like these giant, like these giant prints of like comic book covers, but they're only like two or three dollars. So you get like a shit ton of them, they're super lit. And then over here, you don't really get to see this too much. You get to see it from like an angle on the stream, not as much, but it's basically my pop figure collection. So I'm just gonna do a quick like pan down of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, but yeah, so we have that. We have a Secret Wars poster. We have a, you can't really see it because of the glare, but we have a Darth Vader, uh, Darth Vader and a Kylo Ren image, which is actually really, really cool having them next to each other. There's also a Stormtrooper that goes along with it, but the Stormtrooper really didn't fit, so I have that at my office. My desk at, at work, and my phone is just buzzing. Not important, okay. But yeah, so I have pop figures. I have a shit ton of pop figures. I haven't bought as, I haven't, gotten as many pop figures as I used to. I used to buy like them all the time, but this is like the last little bits of my collection. I have a lot of them at my office. Like I have what, what, three, two offices. I have two offices. One of the offices has like 18 pop figures on the desk and other like, memorabilia type stuff. But yeah, it's lit. Uh, I have a CG book because as I said, I do videography full time. Uh, so I do like a lot of like, uh, Effects and things like that. So this is a birthday gift for my brother. Shout out to him. It's a really, really cool book. Um, it's like a history of like CG or like CGI. It's actually really freaking cool. It's actually really cool. Um, so then over here, I have my Switch dock and my controller, which for the Smash setup, which I eventually will do a Smash setup. I mean, the Smash setup is, is made. You know, I already have everything for it, like the controller, the dock. Um, I have a HDMI. This is a little. Uh, Sub Zero, uh, is it gonna focus? My little Sub Zero uh, thing I got from a loot crate. Really cool. Yeah, I have an HDMI switcher which falls off because it's supposed to be taped on here, like right here. It's supposed to be taped like right there. A little HDMI switcher so I can switch it between uh, inputs. You know that? But yeah, then that goes into that cord right here, and that cord will go into like an Elgato and into my computer. So I just have to set it, I just have to make, make sure all the settings are right, but I hadn't really had time to do that because I'm doing other things. And there's also a webcam here. So um, this is the old, actually the old webcam I was using before I got uh, that one, which we'll go over in a second. But yeah, this, so this would be used for the uh, Smash setup. So I have, I have a shop cord that goes in the computer as well. So all that setup, I just have to make make a little scene for it in my uh, Streamlabs, which I haven't been able to do yet because I'm playing Apex a lot. Apex is like, 
So yeah, that's that setup. Um, this is all full of clothes and stuff right here, which is, if you guys wanna know, because I talk about it all the time, literally, I keep my clothes color coordinated, so I have like black, like blacks, and then this is also black. And then we have like over here, have like gray and white and green, yeah, so. I have a shit ton of shirts, if you don't know. I have a shit ton of shirts, I'm just like, Got a Dutch angle for some reason. Dutch angle. <laughs> uh, yeah, I've had a shirt. I can literally wear a new nerdy shirt every day for about two, three, two or three months. It's crazy. It's actually crazy. But yeah, so the thing what most people probably be interested in is this. Is the stream setup. We'll talk about after we go over here. So we have a Captain America shirt. This is like an old cabinet. You know, there's like not much in there. It's like a original Xbox, uh, my laptop's right here, a bunch of papers and like old textbooks and stuff, there's not much interesting. Really but yeah, so we have the Captain America shield up there, dual disc, like the uh, dual Academy dual disc, you can see it's been, it's been used very frequently, as you can tell by the amount of uh, dust that is currently accumulated on it. We have the banana that I got from a circus, I believe, some shit like that. Um, we have an eagle uh, statue. I don't know why I got it. I just thought it was really cool. So I still have it. So yeah, it, it, it was already broken when I bought it. So you don't worry about that. It's already broken when I bought it. So over here, like British, it's like, I guess my British stuff over here, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, so like Buffy, like Buffy stuff. We have uh, Sherlock stuff and Doctor Who stuff. I've actually never seen any of these shows. These just came in my uh, loot crates. So I was like, I'll just keep them because Sure, why not? Like, I know of them, I've never actually watched a show, so. Yaw yeah, We have my bed, which, as you, as, as you currently know, I'm into Thor, so I have a Thor blanket and a Thor shrine. Super lit. Uh, they say that the posters above my bed, so Star Wars, uh, Amazing Fantasy number one, with Spider-Man, uh, we have Justice League poster, have a, a uh, Bumblebee fat head, not even call it fat head, like flypaper, I think is what it's called. Flypaper, they used to make these a lot, back in uh, like 2008, 2009. They used to have like a lot of these. They had like Transformers one, they had Star Wars ones, they had other ones. They don't do them as much anymore. But it's actually really cool. And then over here, we have a Star Wars poster, which is a really cool original poster. And that was not an original poster, but the original artwork for the uh, movie. Yeah, it's lit. And uh, now we get on to this thing. This thing right here. So I'm gonna take a seat. I'm gonna take a seat. So I'm kind of winded from walking around my room. A little winded, but yeah. This is what my let's see back. This is what my perspective looks like from a stream. So we have like these. These are like three D Star Wars posters right here. I don't think. I don't know if you can kind of tell. Let me see. If you can kind of tell. Yeah. So it's like kind of like three D ish posters that I got from like this place called Ollie's, which has like. If like stores go out of business, they sort of like, or if they have like too much stuff, they like get rid of it and then Ollie's buys it and sells it really cheap. So these are actually really, really cool. But yeah, so that's what those, you guys have actually never seen that because, well, it's on my Instagram. So follow my Instagram. Social media plug, by the way. Social media plug. <laughs> but yeah, so those are the other, this is really cool to have like a little Star Wars, like trifecta having like the posters and then the big poster, really lit. Um, we have, these are for, these are hangers that I got off of Amazon, like they're really, really cheap. They're like six bucks or some shit like that. But it's really cool to have, uh, be able to hang up my uh, headset. Um, so it's not like laying on this at all. It's really, really cool. Um, this used to be one for my controller, but my controller broke. So it's kind of just empty right now. I'll probably fix something and put it on. Uh, this is a Logitech, what is it? Is it nah? I'll post it, uh, whatever, it's like Logitech, Pro Stream 90X or something like that, something like that, something like that. But I'll post a link to it. I'll post post links like if I can remember all the stuff that I showed um, down below in the description to it. But this is a really really cool webcam. It's a lot better than the one I was using before. Because before this is only shoots 720 like 30 FPS, but this shoots like 1080 30 or like 720 60. So really really cool camera, really, really good. It's surrounded by duct tape because I don't know. I was gonna buy a web. I, was, I should probably just buy like a webcam holder for it, you know. I probably should, but I'm lazy, so 
whatever. Um, we have a Logitech keyboard, the Logitech K55 right here. It's really, really, really lit keyboard. Then we have a uh, Logitech uh, G501 mouse. I think it was called G501. Yeah, super lit. I really like. It. I really like bigger mouses because I have a really big ass hand. So having a bigger mouse helps uh, better. The playmat, because I know I'm gonna get asked for it. The playmat is actually from Tespa, which uh, is like a collegiate esports uh, organization. So you can't actually buy this. this is, like you can't actually buy this unless you're part of Tespa. And I think they sold out of these already. But yeah, this is from Tespa. It's really really cool. It's like the full, like one of those large, uh, large uh, mouse pads. So it's really really cool. The artwork is actually really dope as well. Um, the monitors are just like random monitors that had lying around. That's like an Acer, it's like an AOC, I think. I bought this one. This was like one we had lying around the house. So I would game on this one. This was just kind of like a secondary monitor for streaming. Um, this is my microphone. So with Auto this is Auto Tech Auto Technica AT2020. It's a really, really lit mic. If you're looking for like a kind of like starter mic, AT2020 is, well, I won't say a starter mic, but more entry level, uh, entry level like professional mic then this is a really really good mic it's a it's the condenser version so you have to use like an xlr and go into an audio uh and like an audio mixer or some sort of like uh some sort of unit to actually uh power it because it does require phantom power which i'll explain in a tutorial series what that is but this is a uh Bear Ringer Euphoria UM2, really, really good, really, really cheap. Um, so it's really inexpensive. I like to say cheap. It's really inexpensive uh, for what it does. So basically, it allows my mic to go be powered through this and then go into my computer, and then next you can hear everything. So it's really cool. I'm probably gonna get a different one, more uh, professional one, because I use a lot of like secondary programs for my audio. But if I get a separate uh, thing for it, then it will cut down on a lot of things for that. So yeah. So let's have a little Thor figure right here. Like little Thor figure, right because like I said, I like Thor. Thor's my favorite superhero, so I have a lot of uh, stuff around just to do. Uh, so next is the actual uh, computer, which has a not a long story, not a long story, but it's kind of kind of a long story. Yeah, so I bought it initially in like 2015 for an, uh, Amazon's initial like Prime Day. Uh, this was like a computer that was on sale. Like it was initially was like six hundred something dollars, but I got it for like four fifty, which is a really good deal on a gaming computer. But um, it was like an entry level. So this is like my first gaming PC. And, but since then, I've updated like pretty much everything in it. So it's technically not even the same computer. But currently, it has a. Uh, I'll put a list right here of like what it actually has. But it has a Ryzen 5 2600, a uh, GTX 950. I think it has. Eight, eight gigabytes of RAM, which I'm going to up to 16. That's the computer. I'm going to buy a different case. This case is okay, but I don't necessarily need a lot of things. Like I don't need the uh, disk drive. Uh, I think I need a couple more USB ports on it. Um, also, the airflow on this is not bad, but it could be better. So I got to fix all that. I think that's pretty much it. I think. Well, I guess there's also the chair. I guess. So shout out to Vat Kid Deals. Uh, there's a Twitter basically where it's like a bunch of Amazon. Uh, Amazon workers or associates basically they post like Amazon deals um, it's, it's a, lot, a lot of it's like deals you wouldn't actually know about unless you I guess are an Amazon employee or if you're like hardcore to Amazon because you have to use like certain codes and things like that so at least for some products and products so this chair was actually like usually goes for like I think like 180 or something like that but it was actually on sale for like 96 or something like that so I bought it really good um, it's okay it's okay, I had to replace the arms because the arms that it came with didn't actually like go up or down. So I had to replace the arms so my, cause I have like long arms. So my arms would actually like sit on it. Cause before like it would be like the arms only went to like here. It was annoying. So I do that. And then the seat is not terrible. It could be better, but it's only like, I paid like 90 bucks for it. So I'm not really gonna be you know, picky, picky about it. You know, but it's not bad. It's not bad, especially for initial gaming chair. It's not bad, you know. It's not bad. You get what you pay for, you know. If I made one hundred eighty dollars for it, I'd be mad. I only paid like ninety seven dollars for it, so not, not upset. That's pretty much the room tour. You know, not much else, not much else in the room. Um, but yeah, so let me know what you guys think of it. If you guys have any suggestions or questions about anything else in the room, please let me know. I'd be happy to uh, inform you. But yeah, that should be it. 
for me. Thanks for watching. Remember to hit the like button. Remember to like. Remember to subscribe and do all that YouTube shenanigans. But yeah, I'm out. All right, I'll see you cuties in the next one. Remember, you can be whoever you want to be. Do whatever you want to do. Just gotta believe in yourself. Self belief. Is that how you say it? Self belief. Believe it in yourself is most powerful in your life, right? That. Show you guys out later. Do you see?